Hi, I'm Elise Mark. I'm from the United States, from Philadelphia. I'm here in Japan this month, hosted by OSIP at Osaka University, um, to study the U.S.-Japan Health Partnership and how the United States and Japan can collaborate and cooperate with Southeast Asia to improve global health outcomes. Hello, I'm Kyoko Suzuki. I'm from Japan and I was working for the Ministry of Foreign Affairs the past three years. My research is looking into the economic cooperation between Japan, ASEAN and the US and mostly into the reduction of technical barriers to trade among those regions. Hello, I'm Darren from the Philippines. Great. My research assesses the role of the private sector in the trilateral relations of Japan, Southeast Asia, and the U.S. All right, so uh, my name is Courtney Weatherby, and I work at the Stimson Center in Washington, D.C. on Southeast Asia and energy, water, and sustainable development issues. Hi, uh, my name is Hui. I'm from Vietnam. I'm here to work on my research topic about the implications of the U.S.-Japan alliance on the Southeast Asia security institutions. Hi, I'm Kay from Japan and I'm researching the role of U.S.-Japan alliance in the field of water and environmental development in Southeast Asia. I feel lucky to be a part of this fellowship because it actually takes place in two countries. Uh, first, we're in Japan. We'll be in Osaka for a few weeks, and then Hiroshima and Tokyo, and then we get to go to Washington, D.C., where I've had the opportunity to work before, and I'm very excited to take my colleagues. Um, I'm here in Osaka exploring opportunities for the United States and Japan to collaborate or coordinate on energy initiatives in Southeast Asia. After finishing my program, I would like to expand my thought about the economic cooperation among those three regions. And I'm hoping to go back to the government office and make an appropriate proposal. So we are the first cohort of this Dynamic Asia Fellowship. So we look forward to meeting the next group of researchers in, in a capstone conference in Southeast Asia in 2020. I would want to say is that the fellowship wouldn't end with, with the completion of our tasks. 